It's officially stepdaddy season. Yeah, what up? I got the car seat in the back. Let's go to the park. <laughs> Don't let your baby mama or your baby daddy block your blessings. Today's topic. Uh, Brittany Renner. I've been hearing a lot about her lately. Well, never knew who she was until that, I guess, the video of her and that, um, what? Oh, people started talking about her because of that thing that she did to that guy in the PJ Washington, yes. So, now she posted a video. I think it's called Step Daddy Season. Oh, we'll see what she has to say on that. Hey, y'all. Hi. It's officially Step Daddy Season. Yeah, what up? I got the car seat in the back. Let's go to the park. <laughs> Don't let your baby mama or your baby daddy block your blessings. I know in theory it sounds good keeping the same person to have kids with. But that's insanity as well. So it's the All right. So first thing first, Brittany. Um, I already know you're in that um, delusional mindset right now. So uh, it is no surprise. But so it's not that it's uh, nonsense. It's actually, oh, I don't I would say imperative that you're not supposed to be a baby mama. But since that has been pushed so far in this country, then we have a lot of people like you who think it's okay to just have a baby to get money. And so you can read and then later on say, hey, where are the stepdaddies at? Where are the nice guys? Now, I hope this video goes out and shows to the nice guys, hey, guys, do not go after baby mamas. Oh, by the way, before I continue, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. <laughs> It will do a great help. I know most of you like to dislike my videos. That's fine. I'm still going to keep posting until other people start seeing it as well. So, do me a favor. Just like instead of dislike. And subscribe. Because I know you guys watch my videos too. So, yeah. But, let's move on. So, Brittany. Brittany, uh, so I don't really know who you are. I've never heard about you until at this point. I guess I'm not the kind of person who <sighs> wastes time on social media. But hey, um, that one came out. So, but you know what? I got something for you for your next video that I heard that just came out. So, but this one, I'm gonna finish it first. So, guys, let's move on. Let's see what else she has to talk about work out with them it'll work out with someone else okay that's the point number two um you don't know what future holds for you see just because it might have worked out with somebody else doesn't mean it's gonna work out with you actually i'm hoping it does not work out with you in a sense so you can learn not to do those things on purpose some people have tried to fight to stay in their marriage, uh, first thing first, you were never married. Now, I'm not going to say you won't ever get married, but I would hope that no other man picked you up because of your dysfunctional past. Yeah, I, I recently learned about your past from other videos. Yeah, I know. But hey, what am I to say? I just hope it doesn't go well when it comes to your stepdaddy for you. But you know, there's always some simp out there who's gonna 
pick you up and think that you're high quality, but hey, you never know. That's my opinion. All right, let's move on. Okay. It just will. That's how that goes. And trust me, I know it's ghetto. It is so ghetto being a baby mama and thinking about multiple baby daddies is scary. But mm, me and my baby going to be all right. We're going to be all right. So we're moving forward, onward, and upward. Okay? I know. I'll okay, so before I continue, um, Brittany, so you're promising that you're going to be all right. You and your baby are going to be all right. Or your baby and you are going to be all right but we're going to keep that as a receipt all right because five years from now yeah it's still going to be all right maybe but wait till he becomes a teenager now i don't know if you have a boy or a girl whatever you have as a child wait till that child becomes a teenager and start being influenced by society and see how, if it's going to be all right, you know? Yeah, because from what I understood, most children that come from a single parent, mostly mothers, they don't turn out really good in the future. So I don't know what, what, what being all right means to you. If it means you getting money, um, 200k a month, so you can spend and have a lavish lifestyle, Maybe, yeah, it's going to be all right for you. But for the kid, that's a different story because you don't know the kid's future. Well, your future is already set. That's for sure, actually. Your future is so much set right now that you are... Now, if P.J. Washington is not dead yet, or if he, if he's, if he doesn't die in the future, you are promised an 18 year of salary that you have not worked for but all you have to do is use your body and get some money out of it you know let's keep it real you just promise an 18 year of money coming month on a monthly basis on child support which you actually planned and hey since you are good at it i gotta give you props you did what you had to do even though it's wrong, but hey, you know, that's fine. But all that money, hmm. <laughs> Whew. some people are not used to having a lot of money. But, you know, I digress. Let's keep on moving. A lot of you are skeptical about talking to people with children. But I can assure you, the baby mamas now, today, we don't give a damn. All right, yes, that, that's a great thing to say. Because why? So, uh, we've been telling men, you know what, guys, listen, why would you go with a, with a baby mama when you can actually have your own family? Why would you go on a pre-made, well, intentionally, pre-made baby mama because that's what you are you know that's what you are basically right now um it's an intention to get him get you pregnant so you can actually leave him and take money out of his pocket because uh like, like he called in your other videos apparently that you made he was not a smart person mm. but you know what we do tell men younger men who are coming out of maybe high school or middle school, even men in their 20s in their universities. Please, guys, be careful. You need to do some research to know the woman's past, you know. See if she was a Britney Renner, basically. Or if she is trying to pull a Britney Renner. I think I'm going to call that now. Anytime I see a baby mama who decided to become a baby mama, who decided to become a baby, a baby mama, who were never married, I'm gonna be like, wow, why are you guys trying to pull a Britney Renner? <laughs> yeah, it kind of flows together though. But, anyways, 
Yeah, so Brittany, uh, think about it though. I don't know what your life is going to be like in the future, but I can probably tell you it's not going to be easy, it's going to be hard. And you're going to you're gonna cry a lot. That I can show you. You're going to cry a lot because of the difficulty. When life, starts to, when life starts to teach you certain things, it will slap you left and right. And you're going to make money, but that money can turn out to be a misery for you because whoo, God always <laughs> bring back, brings back justice. Yeah. Actually, in that video you talk about, the lesson you made, I have something I'm going to have to read to you. Just so you know, you're not supposed to be uh, playing the devil advocate. Because that's not a good thing to do. But, let's move on. Let's move on. You can have them. I have exited the rat race. I am not threats. I want you to be around for a long time, not a good time. You can hold my son, put him on your story. I trust his judgment. I really do. I really, really do. I just want you guys to be happy. I swear. I do. Now, I'm not a threat, but, you know, I can't speak for the other, 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 other hoes that you don't know about. You know, maybe I'll never be in your favor. <laughs> but I am here for it. Okay? Like, people move on. Save the, you should have got the ring first. It wasn't going to work out anyways. It just wasn't going to work out. Let's laugh together and let's raise this baby, you know? So, it wasn't going to work out anyways, but yet you wanted to make sure it worked out to get pregnant. So you can put him on child support. Hmm. Make that make sense. And you see, honestly, honestly, Brittany, I don't know if you understand what she just did. What she just did right now is what all the women are going to try to do. But us men who have learned about these behaviors, we are making videos so that other men who are willing to learn should not be trapped into your snares, all right? Or into the other Britney Renner's snares because there's a lot of y'all out there. You're not the only one. But since you were at the forefront to do this, hey, props to you. But, and I hope the other, get other men out there or other guys out there who want to keep more money in their pocket learn not to mess with other Britney Renners like you. I know on your Instagram when you posted that video, there's a lot of girls were like, oh, I love you so much, I missed your video because they think they too will have the opportunity to secure that bag that you just did. But I hope they don't get there. Yeah. Because there will be more men suffering for another 18 years. Yeah. And that's going to be a sad reality. And then we're going to have a bunch of children growing up dysfunction, right? Dysfunction. And then they're going to be the next one to teach the next generation, which is going to be also be a dysfunctional generation. And then the country falls down. The country falls and it's in ruin thanks to people like you but you know i'm being facetious because i don't really want that to happen but if that's what you want well, if that's where we're gonna go everything has a consequence to every action
made. Let's keep on moving. We're almost done. <laughs> you know, uh, I, I can also see the hurt in your face. You're trying to play, you're trying to smile to cover it up, but that fake smile, it doesn't, by, it doesn't bypass me at all. I can see right through that. You're, not only you're hurt, because you know you're dysfunctional and you cannot keep a man, but because of that, you want to make sure you get the money at least, but it's still going to hurt for a very long time. That is going to happen. I think you mentioned that in one of your video, you have some issue that you haven't corrected. So maybe you have to do that part first and then, but you know what? It was your boy, <laughs> T-O-V, The Open Veil TV, with another video. So don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, ring that bell as well. Until then, I'm out.